What's happening guys, it's Game Walkthroughs 22 back playing more Super Mario Sunshine and in this episode we are going to finish Peanut Park with a really easy 100 coin mission. Surprisingly, out of all the worlds, Peanut Park surprisingly has the easiest 100 coin mission of them all. So, I'm trying to think what episode I'm going to go to for this. Um, let's go to... Go to episode two. And all you want to do is um, you spray the sand. You get a lot of coins for spraying the sand. So. Basically, yeah, spray the sand, get a lot of coins, and then there's also a uh, crap ton of fruit that pops out as well. Just keep spraying that sand. The sand holds a lot of coins. Just like that, and like that. Not so much like that. Oh yeah, you can spray these bob bombs too. Just throw them, and they give you a coin. Whoa! And they give you coins. And spraying the sunflowers too also give you also gives you coins. That one gives you two coins. This one gives you a coin. Yeah, she gives me a coin as well. Whoa! Watch out for that purple bolt, Bill. He's gonna try to home in on me. Ooh. Ah, uh, that's a yeah, it's a blue coin, which we do not want right now. What you can do is you spray these bullet bills. They give you two coins each, and spraying this purple bullet bill gives you also two coins. But the gold there's a golden bullet bill that he'll fire out, and if you get the gold bullet bill, then um I think you get like several coins, which is really nice. Let's see. Whoa, almost walked almost walked into that blue coin. That would not have been good. Kinda of doesn't matter because I already got two blue coins, but I mean you know. There's a coin on the water. Let's watch out for that gold bullet bill, see where it's gonna be at. So yeah, each bullet. Oh, there it is. Oh, but you wanted to spray it. If you sprayed it, would would have given you a lot of coins, and that coin is really close to that blue coin. Oh god. Ah. Okay. Oh whoa. Nice. We are three tenths of the way there. All right, come on, give me that gold bullet, Bill. God damn it. There it is! Oh boy! Look at all those coins you get when you spray the golden bolt bill. And it's like, don't, it's like, oh, I thought, it's like, oh, I missed my chance. No, you didn't, because he just keeps firing this bolt bill. So as long as you keep spraying them, you will get coins. So the golden bolt bill gives you 10 coins each. That's awesome. And the gold bolt bills are a lot 
more rare because uh, they're gold and they give you a lot of coins, so I mean, they should be more rare. More coins. Just hate how they disappear so quickly. Give you such little time to react. I think. Oh man! It's okay. It's alright. Save and continue. Just whatever. Save and continue. Alright. It's okay. I don't know if I'm going to remember that I got that blue coin there, but, I mean, it's not a big deal. I really did just want to, like, save all the blue coins for, um, uh, the, uh, what's it called? Uh, for the, toward the end of the project, but, I mean, I already got a couple, so... Something to something to whine about. Space bullet bills. Sixty-eight, almost there. All right, come on. So I guess depending on which mission you pick, it's it's not easy. I mean, no, it is easy, but it's not very quick. It's not as quick as I thought it was gonna be. Coins seventy two. Seventy six. Come on, I want another gold bullet bill. It's like the further you are, the further away you are, like the better chance or well, better chance that a gold bullet bill will appear. I don't know. Maybe I'm not sure. Whoa! All right. Ten more. Let's see, come on, that'd be a perfect opportunity to give me a gold bullet bill because. I think each gold bullet bill gives you 10 coins, so I mean, why not? Whatever, you want to be that way? Fine, I'm just gonna just... Damn it, not, not do that. Just keep spraying the bullet bills and just collecting coins. Alright, we got it this time. There we go. So it wasn't necessarily quick, but I mean, well, I guess it was kind of quick because it was a lot. It was it took us like half the time than it did for uh, the other hundred coin mission. So let's go get our shine sprite, and we are done Peanut Park for now. Of course, we will come back to it later to collect the other 29 blue coins. And now, before we enter the fifth world, we are going to save Yoshi from Shadow Mario. So we're finally going to unlock Yoshi. Get over here, asshole. You're not riding that Yoshi. Damn it, I hate when he does that. I hate when he turns around and just like starts causing mayhem and shit. Come on, man, give it up. You're not riding that Yoshi, son. Don't be an asshole. God, God damn it. Maybe I can get him on the rooftop. There we go. Darn, and I was just about to ride that Yoshi too. I bet you were. 
And our good friend Yoshi wants bananas. So let's get him the bananas. So we can finally unlock our good friend Yoshi. You befriended Yoshi, make him meet with B. Of course we will save and continue. Yay, we've got our friend Yoshi! And we need Yoshi to uh, eat this pineapple from the red pipe. And now, whenever you enter a world, um, Yoshi goes bye-bye. So Yoshi will not come with us into this first episode. World 5, Serena Beach. Episode 1, The Manta Storm. Fun fact, this is Silver Mario 72's favorite boss. I'll say this is probably one of the better bosses in the game. Held a lot better than uh, PD Piranha and uh, Gooper Blooper. It's a lot more challenging, that's for sure. Again, you guys probably know what I'm going to say. This used to give me a lot of trouble when I was a kid. Oh, please, tell me my nightmare is over. You can save me. I don't know why, but you just look very capable to me. Listen, it all started around noon. This giant mantis-shaped thing showed up. It was this paper-thin floating silhouette. It came and covered the hotel grounds in, a, in this electric goop. Then, oh the horror, my beautiful hotel, my poor building! It sank in the middle of that awful ooze. Why me? Why? Now I've got the staff cleaning up, but where's my hotel? What am I supposed to do? I can't just sit back and... Ay! It's back! That goss summer! Ghoul, do something! <clears throat> that is the manta. It's a it's a it's a huge shadow that is uh that's dropping goop everywhere. Oh, damn it. All you wanna do is just and, and as you can see, when you spray them they divide. God damn it, they keep knocking me back! And they just spread electric goop everywhere. Now the best strategy what to do for these little buggers is to go all the way out to the ocean. And the same music is playing, um, the same music that is used to, um, that plays when you fight the, uh, the, uh, Goop piranha plant the paint the polluted piranha plants um is playing right now. So that's cool. I haven't heard this we haven't heard this music in quite a while. Yeah! Use that. Yeah, keep using the uh, mega squirt technique. Um that will take them out a lot faster. And then Flood says they're dividing. Of course they're dividing. And they get really small. Look how small they've gotten. And then when they they get so small, and then they become the color pink. When you spray them one more time, then they start disappearing. And God knows how many of these there are. There's a lot. Now they are all. They, now they are all after you. Beware! Oh, just like that. Shit! Shit! They will not die because of these little buggers. Oh my god! They are after me. Oh shit! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh Jesus Christ! All right, come on. Come on, we can do this. Come on, we got this, man. We got this. Oh shit! 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 You know what? Just in case, I do want to actually uh, collect some coins. Might as well. You know, God, these weird coins. A one up. Oh, okay, that works. All right, sweet. Oh yeah, I forgot when you get collect a one up that. Get God damn it, it's assholes, little buggers. God damn it, assholes, just die. 
Just die! Holy shit! I'm just like doing like this really cool tricks. Really cool tricks. Get out of here, get out of here, get out of here! I'm jumping backwards. God. Whoa! Oh shit, why did I do that? I didn't even do that, I didn't even mean to do that. And with that said, uh, the little mantas disappear, and then all of the electric goop disappears, and then a giant ass building comes out of the ground. Damn. That thing is massive. That got, that got buried? That's, that's insane. And there's our shine sprite. So that was a fun boss fight. It looked like I was having some trouble, but I thought it was, I thought it was pretty cool. It was a lot, it was more challenging than uh, PD and Cooper Blooper, that's for sure. So we just got done facing Silver Mario 72's favorite boss. And we have Shadow Mario, and he's got another nozzle. So, might as well, might as well kick his ass. Let's see, where is he? He's right there. He's got the hover nozzle. He's got the hover nozzle. Come on! Damn, I hate when he, like, nudges me like that. Oh, you asshole. There he is. He does. He just he just runs. He just keeps running back and forth on the roof on the rooftops. There we go. Rats! And I was just about to turbo dash too. You got the turbo nozzle. Press and hold R to zoom. So we now have the turbo nozzle for Delfino Plaza. Sweet. But I believe it's gonna disappear. Sweet. Alright. Episode 2, the Hotel Lobby Secret. Another obstacle course. And again, this obstacle course used to give me a lot of trouble when I was a kid. Yep, we do not have the turbo nozzle anymore. Alright, let's see what the hotel manager has to say now. Hey, um, it's Mario, right? Yeah, Mario. Listen, I, uh, have a feeling you can help me out again. See the hotel? It's, well, it's full of, it's full of g g g g g ghosts So, well, could you maybe look just... See, could you maybe look just come inside please I can tell you're a miracle worker don't be so modest no I will not come in and help you with your ghostly needs and for silver Mario 72's favorite Mario character it's boo and unfortunately we have to uh, we have to kill them in this game they're not they're not good guys they're bad guys in this game just look at how look at how they're designed. They're kind of oddly <laughs> designed in this um, for this game. They don't really look like boots. They have like curly tails and like. Oh, damn it! Yeah, you have to watch out for their for their uh, shadow or not shadows. You have to watch out for their um. Yeah, what are they called? Um, freaking. Uh. I, yeah, I guess I guess they're shadows. I guess is what you could call them. And we, then the obstacle course is inside of this Golden Boo statue's mouth. And here's the obstacle course. And see, the obstacle courses are getting a lot more challenging. 
And the background is the same as it was for the Secret of Rico Tower. We've got Stratton Stews, or Stratton Stews, I think they're called. I don't remember. <laughs> and if you hit this block, every time you hit this block, I believe you get a 1-up. Yep, you do. Yep. And we have these flying stews. I don't know what they're actually called. I'm just going to call them flying stews. These sand blocks, which they disintegrate, so they're back from uh, the Dunebud Sandcastle secret. Just be careful. Let's see. Hmm. I totally forgot that those give you a one up. God damn it! Forgot that those gave you a one up. So you can get two one-ups. The little buggers! The little buggers! Alright. I think the most challenging part about this obstacle course is definitely that, um, spinning spiky platform. That screwed me over a lot when I was a kid. As well as the disintegrating blocks, but I think th definitely, yeah, the, the spinning, uh, spiky platform is the most, uh, frustrating part of this obstacle course. So another one up. <clears throat> so I'm gonna be extremely careful. Alright, so yeah, you'll see it starts spinning. As you can see it's green on one side and then it's yellow on the other side. You wanna be god damn it! <laughs> you wanna be careful. You wanna be very cautious because um I think trying to stay on it while it's spinning is a pain. In my opinion. God, I'm sick of having to keep running into you little buggers. Ah, uh, just get the one up. I'm gonna start to lose my patience with this obstacle course, like, very quickly. Oh, close one. God damn it. I probably could have gotten that if I did a spin jump. Come on. No, nope, screw the one up. Man, we are so far away from being game over. Oh, you come on. Are you serious? Oh, this is the opposite course I'm pregnant have the most amount of deaths on. This is so frustrating. Whoa. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
Oh god, okay. I'm gonna really take my time. <clears throat> Not like that! I think you want to start um, walking before I actually start spinning. I think that's what I'm doing wrong. Ah, oh, that's me just being impatient. Finally! Okay. <sighs> That's gonna wrap it up for this episode. <laughs> I did have, like, I think maybe like six or seven depths on that obstacle course, but, um... Thankfully, I was able to finish it. Okay, so next time we're going to continue Serena Beach. And kick Shadow Mario's ass and get that rocket nozzle. So I will see you guys then. As always, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will catch you guys later.